Investing in yourself, recognizing your unique strengths and weaknesses, is the bedrock of success. In the dynamic landscape of life, much like the intricate dance of financial markets, understanding your abilities is a compass guiding you through the highs and lows. In the realm of investments, it's often likened to a zero-sum game, a challenging arena where consensus plays a powerful role. The market, like any collective decision-making process, incorporates the prevailing wisdom into its very fabric. Going against the grain requires not just courage but a profound understanding that your perspective is not only valid but crucial. So, my first piece of advice is simple, invest in what you know, in the skills that set you apart. The consensus may have its strengths, but your unique insights, rooted in self-awareness, can be a beacon guiding you through uncharted waters. Recognize the transformative power of failure. Failure, be it in the market or life, is not a sign of defeat but a transformative force. A market crash, much like a personal setback, has the power to shape your character and refine your goals. It's not just about weathering the storm, it's about emerging from it with a newfound humility or a recalibration of audacious ambitions. When the waves of adversity crash against your aspirations, it's essential to see it as an opportunity for growth. Embrace the struggle, learn from it, and let it be the forge that refines your metal. Failure is not a destination, it's a waypoint on the journey to success. Embrace thoughtful disagreement. In the intricate web of relationships and decision-making, disagreement is not a roadblock but a vital sign of diversity. The art of thoughtful disagreement is akin to a well-balanced ecosystem, where different perspectives coexist and contribute to a richer, more robust outcome. In partnerships, whether personal or professional, open-mindedness is the glue that holds it all together. Aligning with others doesn't mean sacrificing your individuality, it means acknowledging and respecting the different perspectives that collectively shape a more comprehensive view. Thoughtful disagreement is not a clash of egos. It's a collaborative dance where each partner brings their unique rhythm to create a harmonious symphony. Understand your strengths and weaknesses. In the grand tapestry of life, understanding your strengths and weaknesses is the thread that weaves purpose and direction. Knowing what you excel at is not just a personal asset, it's a boon for collaborative problem solving. When individuals come together, each aware of their unique abilities, the synergy is unparalleled. Collaboration thrives on the foundation of self-awareness. It's not about being a jack-of-all-trades but a master of your strengths. Recognize where you shine, and don't shy away from seeking partnerships that complement your skills. The symphony of collaboration is most harmonious when each instrument plays its part with mastery. Meditate on decision-making. In the cacophony of decisions, meditation is the silent conductor orchestrating the harmony between logic and emotion. Decision-making is not just about crunching numbers and analyzing data, it's about tapping into the intuitive and imaginative realms that reside in the subliminal corners of your mind. Meditation is not a luxury, it's a tool for aligning the seemingly disparate elements of decision-making. In the stillness of contemplation, you'll find a bridge between the analytical and the creative. It's in this sacred space that intuition blossoms, and imagination takes flight. Meditation is not an escape from reality, it's a journey inward to discover the depths of your own wisdom. Embrace the struggle-growth connection. Life struggles are not hurdles to be avoided, they are stepping stones to personal growth. The connection between struggle and growth is not a linear path, it's a dynamic dance where each challenge is an opportunity for evolution. To grow, one must first embrace the struggle, not as an impediment but as a catalyst for transformation. Struggling well is an art. It involves not just surviving the ordeal but rising above it. It requires a mindset that goes beyond the immediate pain, transcending the struggle to glean lessons, insights, and a deeper understanding of oneself. The struggle is not the antagonist in your story, it's the subplot that adds richness and depth to the narrative of your life. Worry as a positive force. Worrying is not a manifestation of weakness, it's a manifestation of foresight. In the grand puzzle of life, worrying is the instinct that prompts you to anticipate challenges and create protective measures. 
Life is unpredictable, and worrying is the compass that helps you navigate through the uncertainties. View worrying not as a burden but as a necessary aspect of being proactive. It's not about succumbing to fear but about using it as a tool for preparation. Just as an architect plans for potential earthquakes when designing a building, worrying allows you to fortify the foundations of your life. It's the guardian that keeps you vigilant and prepared for whatever twists and turns the journey may present. In conclusion. So, dear seeker of motivation, invest wisely in your strengths, learn from failures, embrace thoughtful disagreement, understand your unique qualities, meditate on decisions, recognize the growth in struggle, and view worrying as a positive force. Life is a tapestry woven with diverse threads, and your journey is a canvas waiting for the brushstrokes of your choices. Be the artist of your destiny, mindful of the colors you choose, and paint a masterpiece that resonates with the symphony of your unique self. Embrace discomfort as the catalyst for growth, it's in the challenges that you find your true potential. Please consider liking, subscribing, and sharing with friends to support our content.